Hello everybody, John Z here, and today I'm showing you a new drawing command. Okay, here's the code. And what basically it does, it kills a task task what you enter here. Or you can type, type explorer.exe and it will close itself. I added these nifty things, the top, and go to top. Or basically you can do is you can run itself a lot of times and yeah I can show you with a notepad.exe because it's not harmful at all and you can add like I don't know color color R and save it and open it. Oh, what happened? I did something wrong. There are no color air. I want to put the F. Yeah, the F is better. It's uh, really there. And you need to run it as administrator. And see, it's not found, but when I open it, it just closes itself. Don't believe me? This is a CMD. I can close it. And I'll run it again, but first I will open the the notepads. And when you have it opened it, you have what three of them, and you want to close them all. Just run this command. See, they are oh, run as administrator, and see they all are closed. You can add like different programs like I don't know. And bittorrent.exe or something like that. But how you can get processes? This one question you might ask. It's pretty easy. Go here, click on the manager. Here on the the board, you can click anywhere, but don't click on there because then you can just pop up them. Click. I have. I don't have a lot of space. That's why I can click there. I'm going to go properties. No. Uh, click there. Start task manager and then go to processes and you have it all there all of them like example skype.exe you want to end the skype.exe what you do type skype.exe save the command and you see my skype is down there running and the task panel as you can see it too I'll put it in the side Skype.exe, run it. Oh, you know, add the administrator. Run it. See, it's killed. Nothing's there. What when it when it kill when it ends it? What it says? Uh, success. The process. Skype.exe with paid four oh four eight forty eight oh eight had been terminated. You can do the same command in the CMD and then just CMD paste it and notepad the, the exe, the most not harmful thing, and just pop closed. And see, it says that always has been terminated. You can add this command to different bat commands like the, uh, what I showed previously the thing that it opens and cl opens itself and what basically going to do is just going to open itself and end uh, end explorer.exe like this I can show you the co code but use it on, on your own risk here's the code and do explorer.exe exe save it and run it it, it will close the explorer.exe and then you can say the text will enter here and the color we have entered and uh, uh, it will and it will run itself a lot of times and basically there were there will be no possibilities to end it of course, if you have a really good PC, you can press Ctrl Alt Delete and uh, log off the user, or you can just easily turn your computer off. But with
without turning it off. I think there is no possibility that you can end it. Of course, if you have a code like this, task kill, and then task kill the CMD, like here. I'll run it uh, to show what's the co the process, and uh, it's cmd.x, cmd.exe, and you have the command that kills cmd.exe, and it will, uh, this code will try to open itself, but the other code uh, will try to close itself, and then you could then you can end the process. But yeah. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a like down below or just comment down below. I don't know what you want. And if you have any questions, ask. I will answer you. And subscribe if you haven't. Yeah, guys. Bye.